The Northern Luzon journey of the Maharlika Pilipinas Basketball League has just started, as after the doubleheader in Bulacan, the fastest regional amateur basketball event in the country, is moving to Pampanga on Wednesday for yet another twin bill. Pampanga will play host to San Juan in tonight's 9 p.m. encounter. The Lanterns, owned by Ag and Brenz Gonzalez, sons of Congressman Don Gonzalez, will take on a powerhouse Knights team headed by notable ex-pros like Mac Cardona and John Wilson and a solid support cast. Cardona, a former PBA champion who also led the PBA in scoring at the peak of his pro career, will bring his wealth of experience and skills set on the Knights team that is making a return in the regional basketball team since 2002. The Knights had won a championship in the defunct Metropolitan Basketball Association and they're hoping for a return to glory in the league put up by Senator Manny Pacquiao with PBA legend Kenneth Durham serving as commissioner. Aside from Cardona, two other notable PBA players were included in the squad, former Ginebra shooting guard John Wilson and bruising frontliner Larry Rodriguez. Wilson was released by Ginebra before the start of the PBA Commissioner's Cup and was immediately signed up by the Knights. Rodriguez, on the other hand, is a six-foot-four journeyman who won a championship playing for Yang Yao's Rain or Shine squad in 2012. Two more ex-pros were also included, former star hotshot Sam Boy de Leon and Jam Cortez, who had a brief stint with the Phoenix Fuel Masters. But Pampanga is taking pride with its rich heritage of producing great players, from Arwin Santos, Calvin Abueva, Jason Castro, Japeth Aguilar and Ian Sangalang to champion coaches like Gao, former Paranac Patriots head coach Eric Del Rosario and Nato Agustin. The Lanterns will also parade ex Ginebra player Jimbo Aquino, who will be back in mainstream basketball after a few years removed from the PBA. Aside from Aquino, another ex PBA player Michael Juco was also added in the lineup at the last minute to join local players like Alan Enriquez, Marlon Gomez, Jarek Nakpal, Ed Rivera, and Marvin Moraga, all members of the Pampanga based Foton Toplander, who played in the PBA D League and the PCBL. Paranac and Valenzuela square off in the curtain razor at 7 p.m. The Patriots, now being bankrolled by F2 Logistics, also made some key acquisitions in the offseason. The first major changes happened in the coaching staff as the team replaced the veteran tactician Del Rosario and his sons, Edsel and Lester, and Giselle Angeles, and took in Eric Sampson and former national team player Richie Malencio. With several players gone like generic Baloria and Daniel de Guzman, now playing for Pampanga, Gab de Gangan, who moved to Bataan and Jonathan Balorio, who transferred to Basilan, the Patriots will count on holdovers like ex-pro Harold Arbolita, Mac Montilla and Raya El Koga in hope of surpassing what they've achieved last season, where they went a game away from reaching the championship round. The Patriots will be going up against a team that has lost several key players in the offseason, the Classic. Valenzuela lost big man Mac and Aya, but in turn, gets bigger by tapping former Ginebra player Jericho de Guzman, a 6 foot 11 center. The team also lost Mon Mabeo, now playing for the QC Capitals Black Mamba, and dead shot shooter Dryan Salata now seeing action for the Manila Stars' robust energy capsule. 